Hey YouTube, I'm back with another yard sale pickups video. Let me buy this for twenty dollars. It appears to be there. Both wires, system. There's a game. No game. Cool. Twenty bucks. Thank you, sir. <laughs> I appreciate it, sir. Well, it don't mean no good in there. I can use that for my gas tank. I got to jump through that. You found the quarter? That's fine. That's fine. Actually, I don't even have this one, so. That's cool. You still want 20 for it? Are you sure? Awesome. I appreciate that. Where you got a garage sale. And it's. Yeah, I'm not 2.30 at night. Alright, you stay right here and I'll go. Oh. Um, cool. All right, and then I'll give you. You know, there's a system like right? That's fine. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, Have no a good worries. one. <laughs> Thanks. Have a good day. Yard sales. Look at this. Yeah. Oh my god. Mega Man X. Sweet. All right, all right, all right. Calm down. Calm down. I just gotta go like this. You're going through all of them. Love you. Don't make, don't be sour. I'm putting you on the tube now. Yelling at me. What are you playing? Hey. Say hi to everybody. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Show them your hand. How'd you do that? Cooking your dinner. <laughs> Cooking my dinner. <laughs> Good wife. Alright YouTube, I hope you enjoyed the footage. Um, right off the bat we'll start with the Sega Saturn here. CIB. Um, everything's in here. I took the wires and controllers out. The system's still in the bottom here. Still in there. Paid 20 for it. Um, I got the old owner's contact information to see if he can still find any of his games. I paid 20 for this. So uh, I already have a Sega Saturn. I will keep definitely keep the box and add it into my collection. So it should be a nice little piece to put up on my shelf there. So 20 here. Not a bad little find. Definitely cool to find Saturn stuff, especially a box system. Uh, before I get to this stuff, we got the SNES with no controllers with wires that I was going to pay 20 for, and she ended up giving it to me for free. So it's definitely discolored. But that's okay. I'm not going to complain. It's a free system. It came with one game I didn't have, which is... Harley's Humongous Adventure. Harley's Humongous Adventure. So that's that. Uh, DK Country 2. Hopefully it's... There we go. 
and Donkey Kong Country. Nothing like getting free stuff. <laughs> We all know what the Donkey Kong Country looks like. Okay. So this was an amazing score. Um, you can see in the footage there was a game in there I did not notice while I was at the car. <laughs> I was so excited about Mega Man X that I did not realize that there was a specific gem in this lot. What happened was this came up... Alright, I'll, I'll, let me explain this to you. This lot... All right, let me start from the beginning. Me and my wife dropped off the arcade cabinets. I ended up flipping them. Um, I delivered those to a very nice gentleman in New York. And on the way back, a yard sale post popped up on my phone around, oh, what was it, 12.31? And she listed she had video games. So I asked her what she had, and she said she had Xbox, Wii, and a little tub of SNES. So I asked her if she could hold the SNES for me when I got there, and she said she didn't want to hold it unless I sent her $20 PayPal. <laughs> so I was about an hour from home, and this yard sale is no lie, about 15 minutes from my house. So as I'm driving, my wife is sending her $20 via PayPal to hold this for me. So I pull up to the yard sale, showed the time, walked in, because anyone, anyone could have walked to this yard sale. I mean, it was in the middle of nowhere, and there were no signs for this yard sale. It was just laid out on a yard. And I mean, this was a back road. So I pull up, and you saw this tub of other stuff she had, and she, um, I never even opened the tub when I saw it. I gave her the rest of the $40 left, and she told me, have a nice day, and I got in the car. And right away, I saw Mega Man X, and did not notice there was an Earthbound in there. So... I got home, came upstairs, my wife got pretty mad at me because she wanted to go through it because when I first started this we would go through the games together and then I started this. So she wanted to go through the tub with me and she yelled at me while I was going through it in the back of the car so I threw Mega Man X down, got home, put the tub in here, we started going through it and I swear to god I jumped through the ceiling here. Um, there was an implant of my head on the roof. <laughs> so. Ended up paying pretty much $2.50 a game, so let's go through the games quick. So in the Super Nintendo lot, we got Donkey Kong, two in a box. Um, the cart's right here for it. I haven't put it in there yet. We have Super Star Wars Empire Strikes Back in the box, complete. And then a rental case for Super Star Wars. Yep. No info on what store it could have been, but all right. So for the more lesser of value games, we got Tiny Toons. I believe it's Buster. This he is from Tiny Toons. Yeah, if I used to watch when I was younger. Uh, Buster Bust Loose, Mortal Kombat, Shaq Fu. Roadrunners, Death Valley, Rally, Thomas the Tank Engine, I did not have, I have it for Sega, uh, Maximum Carnage, I not have that one either, and the labels on these are, uh, they're pretty crisp, I have to admit, uh, World Heroes, I did not have that one, Goof Troop, I believe I had, hopefully the Focus is a lot better now. Top Gear 2. Turn and Burn, No Fly Zone. Rampart. Take a note again, I've only paid $250 a game, so. Space Ace. Whoa, easy. Uh, Mario Paint. Super Mario World. Super NES, Super Scope 6. And now uh, for the better better titles. Uh, James Bond Jr. Pretty cool. Darius Twin. Gradius. 
the one that everyone got to see, Mega Man X. Happy about that. Super Mario Kart. Always a good find. Uh, Zombie Ate My Neighbors. Did not have that, so cool to have that. We got Turtles 4, Turtles in Time, which is a solid copy. And what made me jump through the roof? We have Earthbound. So, really happy about this. I like that it still has its little void stickers on there. So this was obviously from Rental. Most of the games are. You can kind of see a little bit of stickage on the back here. Um, definitely cool. Very happy about this. Um, there's the back. There's the front. Put it in. Works. Place. Uh, very, very decent label. I'll try to get close up there for you guys. Really happy. Two dollars and fifty cents for Earthbound. So, definitely my best find for this year. Um, we still have more of the year left. Most of my best finds are usually found October, November, because most people stop yard sailing, whereas I will continue on until December if there are any. Which sometimes you get lucky, estate sales. And... But yeah, definitely happy about this. Score of the year. Um, going to do, it's Friday night right now, I'm recording this, I'm probably going to upload it tonight, and, uh, hopefully tomorrow night, which is Saturday or Sunday, I'm going to do a live stream at 9 p.m. Eastern Time of my best yard sale find ever, and it also is my first yard sailing adventure that I've gone on. The footage was lost um, unfortunately, my iPad took a poo, and it won't turn back on. I do have the recap footage of that day, but I don't have any footage regardless. But, you guys will be able to see what I found and hear the story of my first day ever game hunting, garage sailing, and, um, I found the best thing I've ever found on my first day, so... Until next time, guys, if you haven't, please hit that subscribe button. Um, leave a comment on what you found this weekend. If you haven't yet, please enter the Sega Sonic giveaway for your chance to win a Sega. Uh, what else? Put my hat back on. Yeah, so that's just about it for this week. Whoa, what did I do? <laughs> Zoom into that neck fat. All right. So until next time, guys, I will see you next week, and I will see you tomorrow night. So happy hunting.